Hey guys, Queenie K here and welcome to my video. Today I'm basically just talking about nude lipstick on dark skin because apparently a lot of people think it doesn't work but it does and a lot of the lipsticks that I use are considered nude or neutral or pink or whatever and I just make it work for my skin tone so even if you do have dark skin there is there are ways of making it work for you it all just depends on the lip liner you're using and I use the same one for all of my nude lipsticks but you can obviously switch it up depending on what color you want to give off I guess I just like to have my nudes or neutral lipsticks just look more brown rather than um, pink so depending on the lipstick that you have you can use a specific lip liner for that and it automatically just makes it work you just have to recreate the natural effect of your lips and then it'll make sense and it'll look like you have nude lips um, so I'm gonna be showing you guys three pink very pink lip glosses and lipsticks that you would think probably wouldn't work on dark skin but they do um, <laughs> so the first one is the elf um, matte, the e.l.f. matte lip color in the color Tea Rose. You can see it's very pink. The next one is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream and another pale pink. It is in Abu Dhabi. And then this is a Benefit lipstick that is in the color Skinny Dip and it is also a very pink lipstick. Naturally, we all have, um, if you have darker skin, your lips are brown on the outsides and then you have a little bit of pink in the middle. So you kind of have to recreate that effect with different colors. You can't just put one big solid color of pink all over your lips and expect it to look natural. So, Okay, so as you can see, I have no lip stuff on right now. And I just try to recreate this kind of look, but with a lip gloss. So for example, I'll start off with the Tea Rose. If you don't have a lip liner and you put this all over your lips, this looks a bit ridiculous. You can't just grab a pink and fully coat your lips in it. It doesn't work. So <laughs> I'm going to fix this. I'm going to leave it on and I'm just going to fix it with a lip liner, a brown lip liner. So you're just going to take, this is Chestnut by MAC and as you can see this is the most pink, the most ridiculous color and we're going to make it look natural and make it look nude or neutral on dark skin. <laughs> So as you can see, this is the palest pink I have, and it works. Um, so it went from that to this. Um, yeah, and you can do that with any other lipstick. So I'm going to show you guys a couple more examples with my other lip colors. I'm going to use the same stuff. I'm going to use Chestnut by MAC. But again, like I said, you can use any lip liner that you like. Just make sure it is a bit of a different tone. Yes, the color changed a little bit, but you kind of have to make it suitable to your skin. If you're not going to use a brown lip liner for something this pink, you should use like a darker pink. You just have to create the darker effect on the outside and then the pink on the inside.
Okay, so I hope this video helped and you guys can kind of understand that even if you do have dark skin and you are struggling with how to apply lipstick and how to make it work, most of them can work. I have never had a lipstick that I was like, this just can't happen. You just need the right lip liner and if it's not the brown, it's like another, it's something else that matches with it better that might just be darker, you know? So you just always have to make sure you create like a natural look on your lips. Um, this isn't how you should always do it, but this is just like how I do it personally. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you can go out and buy all the pink lipsticks and wear them with confidants. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and leave any comments down below and I'll see you all later. Bye!